right, on today's video, we are gonna be doing a little bit of a different review. We're gonna be reviewing something that I've never reviewed on the channel before. And that is a pair of sunglasses. Now these were sent to the channel from one of my sponsors, Core Essentials, and this is the new Core Recon sunglasses. Now I've been wearing these for about three weeks now. I've worn them to work, wear them when I drive, and I've been wearing them to the gun range. And so far, I am super happy with these sunglasses. There's a lot of things about these that I like that other sunglasses don't have, and we're gonna cover those. If you didn't watch the video before this, we did an unboxing video on these glasses. We showed the case they come in, what these glasses are made out of, the ballistic lenses, we went over all that in that unboxing video. So if you haven't watched that, go back and watch them. Today is just basically gonna be the range video, and I'm gonna show you how to use the sun visor mount in the truck. Now, one of the things that I really like about these sunglasses that other sunglasses don't have is these sunglasses are magnetized. We've got magnets and steel strike plates in here, and you can put these up on your sleeve, and they're not going anywhere. So if you're going in someone's house or you're going into a store and you don't want to wear your sunglasses, you don't want to put them over your hat and stretch them all out, you can clip these right to your shirt, which is pretty cool. Something I've never seen anybody else use on sunglasses. Now, I will say over the course of wearing these for a few weeks, they're super comfortable. I, uh, I own a lot of different pairs of sunglasses. I have Wiley X, I have Oakley's, and I have Under Armour sunglasses. And out of all those sunglasses, I can honestly say these are my new favorite and my everyday pair of sunglasses. So I'm gonna take you to the truck. I'm gonna show you how the sun visor mount works. I'm gonna show you how the cup holder case works. We're gonna take them to the range. We're gonna look through some different optics. We're gonna test out some green dot pistol optics, some red dot pistol optics. We're gonna use an LPVO scope. And I'm gonna give you my overall opinion on what I think about using these at the gun range. Okay, we're in the Dodge. We're gonna put this strap on to hold the sunglasses on the sun visor. We're gonna take that around and we want the logo facing down like this. Get this right where we want it. I want mine right there like that. This is what the back side's gonna look like. Pull this tight, go right there. Now, on this, I'm not gonna need to trim this, but on a smaller car with a smaller sun visor, you might have to take this and cut some of it off. Lock it in place, and there it is. All right, we got our core carrying case with the recon sunglasses in it. We're gonna take these out and those will go right up there, just like that. Nice and tight, not going anywhere. Easy to take off and put them back on. All right, now in the unboxing video, we talked about how the carrying case doubles as a place to put the glasses in the vehicle. Take the top, stick that down in the bottom. And we're gonna put this right down here in the cup holder. Locks in, it's nice and tight. So if you don't wanna use the sun visor, you can put the glasses in the holder right here. Now one thing that I forgot to mention too in the unboxing video, this does have like a little felt liner on the inside so it's not going to scratch the lenses all up it's not the hard plastic like on the outside it actually does have a liner in here so when you go to drop the glasses in you don't have to worry about the lenses getting all scratched up we've got my Glock 40 this is chambered in 10 millimeter we've got 10 rounds loaded up now this has the Swamp Fox cracking on it this is a green dot and it is an enclosed emitter now looking at it with the 
core recons on, the green dot is showing up really nice. So, got a camera down there rolling. We're just going to fire a 10 shot group, see how it does. All right, not the best group. Didn't have anything to do with the sunglasses, but this was a new reload and they're pretty stout. Okay, now we got the Walther PDP Pro. This has the Hollow Sun 509T on it. This is a red dot with the enclosed emitter. The dot looks awesome. Real bright, real easy to see on those red and white side end targets. Alright, here we go. We're going to shoot a group. All right, one thing that I really like about these Core Recon sunglasses, they're not overly dark. Now I'm on the 25 yard range right now and the sun's coming up right behind my targets and I'm looking right at it. Got plenty of protection, the sun's not hurting my eyes, but they're not so dark that I can't see my target real well down there. Now the target I'm shooting at is this side end target in the red and white and I'm not having any issues at all seeing that target. target. Nice little group. All right, we're over on the 100 yard range now. I'm gonna be taking this target down, setting it up, and we're gonna see how well I can see the target at 100 yards with the core recon sunglasses. All right, now at 100 yards, looking at this target, I'm not having any issues seeing the blue on the target. I can see the red bullseye in the middle. So, these aren't hindering me at all with what I'm seeing through this 1x4 optic at 100 yards. Alright, I got a couple USPSA targets set up about 10 yards from me right now. And they're, it's a little hard to see the perfs right now. Now the sun is kind of shining through the trees so there's a shadow being cast here. For USPSA, these might not be the best. I prefer the amber lenses when I'm shooting competition. That's just something to keep in mind that it's pretty hard to see the perf even here at 10 yards with these on. All right, my final thoughts on these Core Recon sunglasses. I love these things. Been wearing them every day now for a few weeks. Been wearing them to work wearing them to the range, wearing them when I'm driving. And so far, these lenses do not have one scratch on them. Now I cannot say the same thing about my Oakleys or my Wiley X's. They always tend to get scratched pretty quickly. So far, these have not. Now, one thing we discussed was the fact that I was talking about the USPSA targets and the brown cardboard targets only have the perforation marks in them. And I was talking about how they were hard to see at 10 yards. And I got on Core's website and I'm gonna put a link in the description. But if you do wanna use these for a dedicated pair of shooting glasses, Core does have clear lenses for these and they also have amber replacement lenses for these. Now. For me, I use the Hunter's HD Gold when I'm shooting competition, and they are amber lenses, 
and they're perfect for competition style shooting, especially USPSA or IDPA or IPSC when you're shooting at brown cardboard targets. So if you do want a pair of these core sunglasses, because I can tell you right now, they are a lot cheaper than the Hunter's HD Gold glasses that I have. You can buy the amber lenses for $19.99 on their website, and you could swap them in and out even if you wanted to. So if you wanted, if you got a competition coming up, you can take the sunglasses lenses out and put the amber lenses in or clear, depending on what you like shooting with. And you got a versatile, all around, awesome pair of glasses. As far as everything else goes with these, they're perfect. I mean, you saw at the range, I wasn't having any issues seeing the red and white side end targets at 25 yards out to 100 yards. Wasn't having any issues seeing the red dot on the handguns. The green dots were fine. The reticles in the scopes were great. They're super, super comfortable. And I got a, I got a big head. And I mean, these things just, I can wear them for hours. I don't get headaches from them. They're just an awesome pair of glasses. Now, they are a little pricey. The recons are $159.99. Now, a lot of people are going to say, oh, I'm not going to spend that for sunglasses. But there are a lot of people that do. There's a lot of people that buy Oakleys that cost a lot more than these. There are people that buy Wiley X sunglasses that are right on par with these. And a good pair of sunglasses is a nice thing to have, especially when they're ballistic glasses like these. Now, if you are interested in buying a pair of these, you can use the code Chris from the 740 on CORE's website and you will get 10% off of these sunglasses. All right, so I highly recommend the CORE Recon sunglasses. These things are tough, they're comfortable, and they are definitely going to be my new everyday pair of sunglasses. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.